Hey everybody, it's Felicia, aka Miss Hot Mess and a Randomness. So, um, I've been pretty quiet about this. Um, I decided to escape America. Um, I officially made it for the first time across Transamerica, um, aka the Atlantic. I crossed the pond. I'm currently sitting in Dublin. Just had to do it quick because I don't have people's permission. Um, sitting in Dublin's airport. Oh my god, so, okay, seriously, if you're ever going to fly across the pond, um, regardless which way, I I haven't experienced any other airlines, but um, compared to the U.S. versus um, international, um, Aer Lingus is actually a really awesome airline. So, um, they, they give you an in-flight meal, which is like legit like two sections they give you a like we got mozzarella cheese basil um pesto and um some um tomatoes basically um nice little thing nice little container literally, literally like like that but it was it was worth it I mean, like the amount was perfect then we got a little little mousse cup um chocolate mousse with like really good chocolate like a chocolate mousse with hard chocolate on top um then you got a little roll with a little piece of butter and then um what else um oh then um you they gave you basically your cream and your sugar and they could actually use um basically kind of like a wood type silverware um cut our um utensils which I thought was really good because it's biodegradable um I feel like there's something else I'm missing for the food uh, just bear with me I might remember in a few minutes but then also um oh yeah so the role of that but then they'll ask you if you want chicken or, or meat and or uh, beef and it's in this little container which is re like really nice temperature hot nice and warm but it's like so I got beef so it was kind of like a shepherd's pie but like the the um, potatoes were on one side. The beef um, was kind of like like um, a cube beef um, in gravy, and then also with carrots, um, like nice sliced carrots. And it was really yummy. I feel like I'm missing something else that that I ate. Um, and it's kind of aggravating me, but it was definitely. Will they give you water with it too? And before that, they'll ask you if you want drinks. And I got a nice like size Sprite, like. Probably at least 10 ounces in, in a um, thing. Um, so food wise, great. And then in the morning, um, like so, or when you, before you get ready to land, you get a, another container, which I actually didn't eat it. So, and I'm dropping things. So. Okay. So, with this, and you get a nice little muffin. Nice little muffin. And a orange juice. But in all honesty, if you were on a US flight, you would not have gotten that. Um, in my opinion. Um, so or all that. So I thought that was pretty good. Plus their in-house entertainment. Free. Like, I saw HBO Max, I saw, like, they had a variety of movies that have all been out recently, like, legit recently, um, recent, like, they had Spider-Man um, Home, No Way Home, um, not No Way Home, the last one, I just totally focused on it, um, the one with three Spider-Mans, um, they, um, they had up-to-date movies, but they had old-school ones that shows, they had HBO Max for like Sex and the City, they had games on it, um, then you can also track your flight, so if you don't already have my Facebook page attached, like go check that because I posted some pictures of, of that, so yeah, I'm, I escaped the country because in a couple days I turned 32 years old, so I decided that I wanted to go and see um, a friend. Then also, I kind of got an amends to do. Um, again, if you guys don't know, um, I'm in recovery, and so this is the first time I've been on a 
international flight sober so far so far i'm on the first leg of the trip so last time i traveled out of the country i was not sober in any way shape or form and this is pretty cool so um so yeah i'm definitely enjoying myself so far um dublin airport is definitely equivalent to disney because of the fact that the amount of cardio you get from going from one plane to the other but i am definitely having a blast so far so yeah i will keep you guys updated and i hope you guys have a great day now i'll probably maybe do a video in london um because i'll be there for my birthday and i'll be hanging out throughout England and I'm gonna butcher half the town's names like my friend um, is in Chorley and um, we're supposed to go to Blackpool and um, I forget the car show's name but we're gonna go to that so there's a whole bunch of things we're gonna do so okay guys if you don't already do it like subscribe share and comment um, have you guys traveled out ever um, yeah um, what's your thoughts Thanks. Bye, guys.